don't know. But then we need to set up a limit. The real no. <laughs> no. We'll see it as we'll a sign. We'll see. We'll see. We yep. 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 So you're going. Let's make sure everybody has a chance to rejoin. It looks like the sound is working better. We have a Why don't you guys start going again? My name is Kelly. Big voice. In fifth grade. My name is Lawson Maybe, and I'm in sixth grade. My name is Eva Rajkin, and I'm in seventh grade. Oh, uh, yeah, Maggie, go ahead. My name is Hannah Litton, and I'm in eighth grade. My name is Elena Bowling, and I'm in eighth grade. My name is Eddie Jarvis, I'm in eighth grade. My name is Ruby Jury, and I'm in sixth grade. My name is Judah Giles, and I'm in seventh grade. My name is Rosie, and I'm in fifth grade. My name is Brian Norris, and I'm in eighth grade. My name is Ivy Howells, and I'm in seventh grade. My name is Henry Iker, and I'm in sixth grade. My name is Michael Giles, and I'm in fifth grade. Thank you, my I'm in fifth grade. My name is Tina Barron. I'm in eighth grade. My name is Gabe Solomon. I'm in sixth grade. My name is Jennifer I'm in sixth grade. My name is Skylar and I'm in fifth grade. My name is Lawson Ruby, and I'm in sixth grade. My name is Maggie Hoffman. I'm in my name is Hannah Litton, and I'm in eighth grade. My name is Elena Walling, and I'm in eighth grade. Eddie, start with your favorite subject in school. My name is Eddie, and they're not even, they came in, like they haven't even gotten on it yet because it's a new street. <laughs> favorite subject, everybody go. Eddie. Eddie, my favorite subject is math. My name is Judah, and my favorite subject is March. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Judah Giles, and my favorite subject is math. My name is Rosalie, and I'm in fifth grade, and my favorite subject is reading. My name is Brenda Norris, and my favorite subject is math. My name is Ivy Howell, and my favorite subject is history. My name is Henry, and my favorite subject is math. My name is Micah, and my favorite subject is history. My name is Lawson, and my favorite subject is math. My name is Ivy Howell, and my favorite subject is history. My name is Brenda Norris, and my favorite subject is history. Eddie, it's the place you want to visit. My name is Eddie, and I want to visit. <laughs> you want to visit your home. Go ahead. Keep going. My name is Ruby, and I want to go my name sure is knows. Judah Giles, and I want to go to the Jones Park Institution. My name is Rose, and I want to go to Texas. My name is Brenner, and I want to go to Missouri. My name is Ruby, and I want to go to Florida. My name is Henry, and I want to go to Germany. My name is Michael, and I want to go to Hawaii. My name is Canada, and I want to go to Mexico. Nobody can hear me. My name is Taylor Barry. I want to go to Germany. My name is Ron Ford. I want to go to Utah. My name is Skylar Knowles, and I want to go to Hawaii. My name is Lawson Weeby, and I want to go play basketball. I want to go to Hawaii. My name is Calvin Bagg, and I want to go to Canton, Ohio. 
My name is Maggie, and I'm going to go to Oklahoma. My name is Hannah, and I'm going to go to Canada. My name is Elena, and I would like to go to South Korea. Yeah, that's not real. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're good. Yeah, we're good. Here we go. All right, you guys ready? Thank you for being so patient, right. ladies and gentlemen. Good job. So good job. Hopefully someone come tell us if we're dealing with more issues. <laughs> All right, I've got some stuff to read to you. Make sure everyone's clear of the rules and just how this works. Um, the four teams competing in the school tournament, uh, those are the Glizzy Gladiators with Eddie, Ruben, Judah, and Rose. The Pacific with Calvin, Eva, Lawson, and Skyler. The Quizards of Oz with Taylor, Olivia, Gabe, and Cameron. And the Geniuses with Brenna, Ivy, Henry, and Micah. The four teams competing in the school tournament will compete in a double elimination tournament. Uh, teams must lose twice before being eliminated from the competition. Seeding for the tournament has been drawn at random. Teams will battle head-to-head -head until a school champion is determined. The winner of the tournament will be crowned school champions and will have the opportunity to advance to a regional level of competition. The tournament format will be buzz-in style with 10 questions being asked per match. The team with the highest number of points after, each, after all questions have been asked will win the match. Each individual question is worth one point. Teams will be granted 15 seconds to provide an answer to each question asked. After a question has been asked, teams may consult with one another during the 15-second time limit. However, an answer must be provided before the time limit is up. The, team, the first team to buzz in will have the opportunity to answer the, the question first. If they answer incorrectly, then the opposing team will have the opportunity to answer the question. However, no additional time will be allotted. If a team buzzes in prior to the completion of the question, then the team must provide an answer without the question being finished. If a wrong answer is provided, the opposing team will get the question reread to them and the chance to answer uncontested. But the 15 second rule still applies. Questions will not be repeated after they have been asked to their entirety. Make sure to pay close attention to the question, uh, to the question as it is being read the first time. In the event of a tie, teams will enter a sudden death playoff in which the first team to buzz in and answer the question correctly wins. Remember to listen carefully to each of the questions. Shortened forms of people's names are acceptable, such as Jefferson for Thomas Jefferson. However, if an answer requires a specific title, then it must be provided. For example, King Henry would not be an acceptable, acceptable answer for King Henry VIII, just as Roosevelt would not be specific enough for president because we have two Roosevelts. In the event that I need a ruling from the judges on an answer, their decision is final and not up for debate. If they determine that the answer is not acceptable, the opposing team will be allowed to attempt an answer as long as they have not attempted already. You guys ready? Mm -hmm. All right, let's finally begin. All right, up first we have the Glizzy Gladiators and Pacific. Have you guys tested your buzzers already? No. 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 I should be testing. Let's do a quick buzzer check. Elena, go ahead and run them through. And let's start with Rose over here and just work our way down. Green one. Green two. Green three. Green four. All right. Very good. Here we go. Question number one. Which man founded the Mongol Empire and was the grandfather of Kublai Khan? Green four. Green four. Can you say that out loud? Attila the Hun. Attila the Hun is incorrect. Uh, Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan is correct. Number two. What silversmith was noted 
for a nightmare or a nighttime horseback ride at the beginning of the American Revolution? Green two. Um, Paul Revere. That is correct. Number three, James Watson and Francis Crick discovered the structure of what compound with the assistance of Rosalind Franklin in 1951? Time. Answer is DNA. DNA. Yeah. Number four, which... German revolutionized the distribution of information with his 15th century invention of the printing press. Johannes Gutenberg. Johannes Gutenberg is correct. Number five. Frederick Mullenberg was the first man to hold what position, which, which has been held by James K. or James Polk, Joseph Cannon. And most recently, Nancy Pelosi. Speaker of the House. Um, I'm sorry, I cannot accept that answer. Time. Correct answer was Speaker of the House, but we did have a before before you were recognized. Sorry. Number six. Who was the king of England during the American Revolution? Uh, king Henry III. Uh, is incorrect. Green Ford, Robert. Also incorrect. Correct answer is George the Third. George the Third. Number seven. What former British colony has been led by prime ministers, including Pierre Trudeau and Lester Pearson? Green Ford. Australia. Australia is incorrect. Time. Time. Correct answer is Canada. Canada. Number eight. Catherine the Great was the longest ruling woman to lead what country? Green Ford. Russia. Russia is correct. Number nine. Which U.S. Commonwealth was devastated by Hurricane Maria in 2017? Green Ford. Puerto Rico is correct. Number 10. What French leader was defeated at the Battle of Waterloo? Uh, thinking of them in my head. It's. Need an answer? Uh, it's Napoleon. Napoleon is correct. Napoleon is correct. Okay, that is 10 questions. At the end of our first round, we have... Gladiators 2. 1, 2, 3, 4. Pacific is 4. Pacific 4. So Pacific wins round 1. Okay, you guys can go ahead and find a seat behind you. I need the Wizards of Oz and the Geniuses to come up here. Can I have quizzers over here, please? Is that what you are? Quizzers okay. and genius. Right? Okay. Oh, we're good. Yeah. All right, you guys ready? Let's begin. Hillary Clinton served as a senator for what U.S. state after her husband's presidency? Green, green, California. California is incorrect. Fine. Correct answer is New York. New York. 
Number two, what nation is home to the only, the only extant wonder of the ancient world? Egypt. Egypt is correct. John Pershing was the highest ranking officer in the United States during what war? World War II. World War II is incorrect. World War I. World War I is correct. Number four. The Statue of Liberty was a gift to the United States from what year? I'm sorry, I cannot accept that answer. Since it was an interruption, I'll reread the entire question for, for you guys. The Statue of Liberty was a gift to the United States from what European country? France. France is correct. Number five. New Sweden was a former colony that contained land now in New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and what other state? New York. New York is incorrect. Red green. Or green green, sorry. Maine. Maine is incorrect. Correct answer is Delaware. Number six. What English queen seceded Mary the First and reigned during the defeat of the Spanish Armada in 1588? Queen Elizabeth I. That is correct. Number seven, Russia annexed the Crimean Peninsula from what neighboring country in 2014, leading to its expulsion from the G8? Ukraine. Ukraine is correct. Number eight, which device used for beheading was commonly used? Guillotine. Guillotine is correct. Number nine. The second oldest college in the United States can be found in Williamsburg in what U.S. state? Red one, New York. New York is incorrect. Green three, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania is incorrect. The correct answer is Virginia. Number 10. The United Kingdom joined the European Union in 1973 along with what country with cities including Cork and Limerick? Green 3. England? England is incorrect. Nine. Correct answer was Ireland. Ireland. At the end of round two? Quizzers five, geniuses one. Okay. Uh, you guys can go ahead and return to your seats. You have Pacific on that side. Yes, Pacific on this side, please. Okay, well, Pacific and Quizzers of Oz. Quizzers of Oz, you can come back up. All right, let's begin. This is round three. We have the winners of both of our first two rounds here. Number one, which former U.S. vice president was known for commuting during his tenure in the Senate with Wilmington? Green four. FDR. FDR is incorrect, and I'll reread the question. Which former U.S. vice president was known for commuting during his tenure in the Senate with Wilmington to Washington daily on Amtrak? Who was 
Time. Time. Correct answer is Joe Biden. Number two. Which playwright wrote King Lear and Julius Caesar in Elizabeth? Shakespeare. Shakespeare is correct. Can Calvin speak any louder as well? Uh, it's not okay. Number three. What founding father gives his name to a hit 2015 Broadway musical? Four. Hamilton. Hamilton is correct. Hamilton. What name, sorry, number four, what name is now given to the city once known as Constantinople and Byzantium? Four. Istanbul. Istanbul is correct. Mm -hmm. Number five, Anne Sullivan is best known for teaching what blind and deaf social <laughs> activist? Green, or red, green. Helen Keller? Helen Keller is correct. <laughs> Number six, the Supreme Court ruled that the separate but equal doctrine was unconstitutional in what landmark 1954 case? Green four. Ah, yo, Dred Scott. Dred Scott is incorrect. Green, red three. Thomas versus the people. That is incorrect. Quick answer is Brown versus the Board of Education of Topeka. Number seven. Victor Emmanuel II became the first king of what unified Southern European country in 1861? Red three. Um, Russia? Russia is incorrect. Um, correct answer is Italy. Good. Number eight. What was the only major U.S. Civil War battle to be fought in the state of Pennsylvania? Red three. Gettysburg is correct. Number nine. Thomas Paine wrote about the need for American... Red three. Common sense. Common sense is correct. <laughs> Number ten. Which English king, known for his six wives, founded the... Henry VIII. Henry VIII is correct. Ten questions. Ten questions. Pacific three, Quizards four. Okay. <laughs> okay. I need Glizzy. Glizzy gladiators over here and geniuses over here. Okay, guys, uh, both teams sitting here have one loss. Is that correct? Yes. So this is our first elimination round. The team who loses this round will be eliminated. You guys do not have to leave. You can continue to watch the history of once you are out. So one of these teams will move on. One of these teams will be eliminated. All right. You guys ready? Let's begin. Number one. Which state became the 49th to join the Union in 1959? Green two. Uh. Alaska? Alaska is correct. Number two. Theodore Roosevelt became the first president to leave the U.S. while in office to visit what Central American nation? Green two. South Korea. South Korea is incorrect. <coughs> Red one. Africa? Africa is incorrect. Correct answer is Panama. 
which wizard, oh sorry, number three. Number three, which wizard of Menlo Park is credited with having invented the record player and the incandescent light bulb among Red three. Thomas Edison. Thomas Edison is correct. Oh, I'm sorry. I was thinking about him. Okay, never mind. I was hearing voices. Number four. Which South Pacific Island country's indigenous population is known as the Maori? Red three. Um, Hawaii. Hawaii is incorrect. Green two. Fiji. Fiji is incorrect. Correct answer is New Zealand. Number five, South Africa was ruled under what system of racial discrimination until the 1990s? Black and white. Black and white. Time. Time. Correct answer is apartheid. Apartheid. Number six. Who was the first woman to serve on the Supreme Court of the United States of America? Green two, Nancy Pelosi. Nancy Pelosi is incorrect. Red two, Hillary Clinton. Hillary Clinton is incorrect. Correct answer was Sandra Day O'Connor. Number seven, on which continent did the civilization of the Incas develop? Red three, um, South America. South America is correct. Number eight, which territorial acquisition took place in 1803 and saw the U.S. nearly double? Red three, the Louisiana Purchase. The Louisiana Purchase is correct. Number nine, along with Germany and Italy, what island nation fought on the side of the Axis powers in the Red three. Japan. Japan is correct. And number 10, Fidel Castro worked to overthrow the government of Fulgencio and Batista, oh, sorry, Fulgencio Batista in what Caribbean nation in 1959? Time. Did you start the timer? You told you me to start it. You told me to. It should be as soon as I get done reading the question. You told me to start it whenever you start the question. I finished the question. Um, let's just move on to the next question. We'll have a new number 10. Why would it? I'm sorry. Good. Number 41. What president was assassinated while seeing the play Our. President. I'm sorry, cannot accept that. Let's reset. I can reread the question. Oh, let's reset. I should have oh, said okay. that right away. What president was assassinated while seeing the play Our American Cousin? Green to Abraham Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln is correct. Okay, 10 questions. Okay. Glizzy had two, the geniuses had four. Okay. <laughs> okay, so after round four, the Glizzy Gladiators are eliminated, and the Wizards of Oz have one loss. Alright, so this is round five, so we need the winner of round four, which is the Genius. And the loser of round three, which was Pacific. Okay, so we need the geniuses here. We need Pacific here, please. You're going to have to switch. Oh. What? What is it? No, I mean, Taylor? Did you say that the Wizards had one loss? I meant the uh, Glizzies. Glizzies are the geniuses. Or I meant Glizzies don't have a loss. Yeah, I meant okay, the Glizzies are fine. Yeah. Glizzies are fine. No, you guys do not have a loss. You're fine. Three. Don't 
double checking here. One of them, four, two, six, two, seven, three, Pacific. Okay, so we have the geniuses and Pacific. Again, both teams here have one loss. So this is another elimination round for us. Okay, uh, are we ready? Here we go. Number one, the Parthenon in Greece's capital was built to honor what Greek goddess of wisdom and strategy? Green floor. Um, Athena. Athena is correct. Number two, Emilio Aguinaldo served as the first president of what Asian island country following the Spanish-American War? Grand Four. Singapore. Singapore is incorrect. Three, two. China. China is incorrect. The correct answer is the Philippines. Number three. David Cameron resigned as British Prime Minister in 2016 following a referendum on which issue? Red four. Brexit. Brexit is correct. Number four. What Civil War battle ended with the surrender of General Lee to Grant in Central Virginia? Red Four. Uh, Battle of Shiloh. That is incorrect. Correct answer is Appomattox. Appomattox. Number five. The English Civil War ended with the establishment of the Commonwealth led by what Lord Protector of England? Red four. The Prime Minister. That is incorrect. Time. Time. Correct answer is Oliver Cromwell. Number six. Angela Merkel is the first woman to lead what country that formed after its western and eastern portions reunited in 1990? Green two. Russia. Russia is incorrect. Red to Germany. Germany is correct. Number seven. The Lewis and Clark expedition returned to St. Louis after reaching Fort Clatsop in what is now what Pacific? Green four. California. California is incorrect. I'll reread the question. The Lewis and Clark expedition returned to St. Louis after reaching Fort Clatsop in what is now what Pacific Coast state? Red four. Oregon. Oregon is correct. Number eight. What American president died shortly after being elected to a record-setting fourth term? Red four. Uh, FDR. FDR is correct. Number nine. What Canadian province voted against the independence in two referenda in 1980 and 1995? Green two. Quebec. Quebec is correct. And number 10. The capital of New Zealand is named for what British war hero of the Battle of Waterloo? Green two. 
Red four. Uh, New Hampton. New Hampton is incorrect. Time. Correct answer is Duke of Wellington. Genius is two, Pacific four. Okay, so Pacific will move on, and geniuses, sorry, you guys are eliminated. We're down to two teams, correct? Yes. Only if it's an interruption. Only if it's an interruption. But otherwise, just use the remainder. Yeah, you so Pacific over here, Quizzards over here. <laughs> yes, because they will have to <laughs> Okay, guys, uh, this is our first of potentially two championship rounds. Uh, if the Quizards win this round, they will be the champions of the History B. Uh, if the Geniuses, uh, Pacific, sorry, if Pacific wins this round, we'll go into a final round, and whichever wins that round will be the champion. So, uh, both teams ready? All right, let's begin. Number one. The first Catholic president was credited as the author of the book Profiles of Courage in 1957 while serving as a senator from Massachusetts. Red three. Franklin FDR is incorrect. Green four. Uh, um, John F. Kennedy is correct. Hannah has to leave. Um, Mr. Rafina, or Kaylee, you want yeah. to do it? I can do it. Okay, let's see what I'm going to do. Remember, C is always a good answer. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh. Good. Number two. Number two. Jawaharlal Nehru and his daughter and grandson all served as prime ministers of what country? The largest. Red three. Greece. Greece is incorrect. I can reread the question. Jawaharlal Nehru and his daughter and grandson all served as prime ministers of what country, the largest democracy in the world? Green four. France. France is incorrect. Correct answer is India. Number three. What king of the Franks was crowned Holy Roman Emperor in Aachen in 800 AD? Green four. Uh, Julius Caesar. Julius Caesar is incorrect. Are we on time? Oh, yeah. Okay. Sorry. 
sorry. <laughs> Correct answer was Charlemagne. Number four. Francisco Franco ruled as dictator of what European country following its 1930s civil war? Green four. Spain. Spain is correct. Number five. Christopher Columbus founded the first European settlement on what island, now home to Haiti? Green four. Uh, Plymouth Rock. Plymouth Rock is incorrect. I'll reread the question. Christopher Columbus founded the first European settlement on what island, now home to Haiti and the Dominican Republic? Red one. Cuba. Cuba is incorrect. Correct answer is Hispaniola. Hispaniola. Oh, wait, I don't know what that was. Number six. The Battle of Zama was fought between Carthage and which ancient republic during the Second Punic War? Green four. Rome. Rome is correct. Number seven. Which president of the USA in the 1980s had previously been an actor in Hollywood? Red three. John F. Kennedy. John F. Kennedy is incorrect. Green four. Ronald Reagan. <laughs> Ronald Reagan is correct. <laughs> number number eight. What man served as Secretary of State to Presidents Nixon and Ford and won the Nobel Peace Prize for his work on negotiating a ceasefire in Vietnam? Time. Time. Correct answer is Henry Kissinger. Henry Kissinger. Number nine. What abolitionist published the newspaper The Liberator? Benjamin Franklin. Benjamin Franklin is incorrect. Time. Correct answer is William Lloyd Garrison. Number 10. Which Roman emperor seceded Trajan and constructed a barrier wall in Britain? Green four. Uh, Hadrian. Hadrian is correct. Let's see where we stand. Okay, so in our first of what will be two championship rounds, uh, Pacific wins five to zero. We'll move into one final round since now both teams here have one loss, uh, and this round will determine the champion of the history. Okay. We'll just stay in the same seats that we're at. Question? Question? Dave Rose. Dave Rose. Okay, we can't get them on. It may just have to be the, the Maverick show. Yeah, let's do the Maverick show. <laughs> is he is he back? Is it the Yeah. Let's give him a little bit of time and see if he can get back. Are you fully charged? Do you think that's Yeah, so we should be on his end, right? How many bars are you at? Yeah, quick on. All right. Um, Maverick, just go ahead and leave that there, and if he shows back up and let him join but um for now you can buzz for yourself okay. good yeah. all right very good okay uh in our final round this is the last round of the history b uh, one of these teams will be the champion here we go you guys ready all right 
Antonio Lopez de Santa Ana was a general who later became president of what Latin American nation? Green four. Go ahead and go green four. Green four. Uh, Mexico. Mexico is correct. Okay. Number two. The oldest existing parliament, the Alting, can be found in what island nation's capital? Red Britain. Great Britain. Great Britain is incorrect. I will reread the question. The oldest existing parliament, the Alting, can be found in what island nation's capital? Capital at Reykjavik. Green four. Uh, Scotland. Scotland is incorrect. Correct answer is Iceland. <laughs> Number three. Singapore was a part of what nation until... Green four. Great Britain. Great Britain is incorrect. I'll reread the question. Singapore was part of what nation until 1965 that shares land borders with Indonesia and Thailand? China? China is incorrect. Correct answer is Malaysia. Number four. What American city was ravaged by fire in 1871, destroying... Green four. Uh, San Francisco. San Francisco is incorrect. I'll reread the... Maybe not. Three. Go ahead. Chicago? Chicago is correct. <laughs> Number five. Which war saw the Battle of the Bulge and the battles of the battles of Green Four? Uh, World War One. World War One is incorrect. I'll reread the question. Which war saw the Battle of the Bulge and the battles of L? Alamein. Red three. French and Indian. French and Indian War is also incorrect. Correct answer is World War II. World War II. <laughs> Number six. Number six. Which man became the first Norman king of England following the Battle of Hastings in 1066? Red three. King Henry the Eighth is incorrect. Green four. Uh, William the Conqueror. William the Conqueror is correct. Number seven. In the Persian Gulf War, an Allied coalition fought which country, led by Saddam Hussein, that had Green four. Iraq. Iraq is correct. Number eight. Which Polish politician founded the Solidarity Trade Union before becoming the president of Poland? Time. Time. Correct answer is Lech Walesa. Number nine. What American company created the supercomputer Watson to compete on Jeopardy? Green Ford. IBM. IBM is correct. And number ten. What German military leader was nicknamed the Desert Fox during World War II? Sure. That is incorrect. That's time. Time. Correct answer is Erwin Rommel. Erwin Rommel. So at the end of our championship round, yeah. Pacific Four, Wizards One, uh, Pacific, you are our History B champions of 2020. Great.
Uh, everyone in here, Haley, if you want to take a picture of the whole 